the Bristol Fair Trade Network aims to promote the use and awareness of fair trade in the city of Bristol. So um, by trying to hold sort of fairly high profile events and campaigns and things, we're basically trying to tell the people of Bristol about fair trade, what's out there, mm -hmm. um, what different products there are, where you can buy them. We produce a fair trade directory every year, again to tell people locally where they can buy fair trade products and to give a bit more information about the more unusual fair trade things for people to seek out and some of the smaller companies they might not be aware of locally as well. Mm -hmm. And obviously that all feeds into the big fair trade picture as if more people are buying it, it benefits more producers, which of course has a brilliant kind of effect in poorer countries. If you buy a fair trade product and the money goes to the producer, it's mm -hmm. as simple as that, it's a really simple relationship. Um, and actually in fair trade a lot of the middlemen are left out. Mm. So if you buy a pack of fair trade coffee, that only then goes to the company like Cafe Direct or whoever it is, who then pays the, the cooperative group of farmers. And the main benefit we hope from the fashion show is that more people will buy fair trade clothes um, and the key benefit there is for cotton farmers because uh, it's been really, really tough in recent times for cotton farmers because, as you know, our clothes are getting cheaper and cheaper mm -hmm. and of course the price of cotton has had to go down and down for the companies to be able to provide us the cheap clothes that we're kind of expecting now. And actually there's been a really high incidence of suicide amongst cotton farmers, particularly in India, because they're getting into deeper and deeper debt and still can't feed their families, which must be an awful thing to do, mm -hmm. where you're working harder and harder, using more and more pesticides, making yourself ill, and actually you're still in debt. So cotton is a really key area, and that's why we wanted to do a fashion show to try and raise awareness about fair trade fashion, because most people know about, about the bananas and coffee mm -hmm. and that sort of thing, but not so much about the fashion. So we hope the benefit has been, as I say, that more people would sort of look at it and go, oh, actually, there's some great fair trade fashions out there, we must seek them out, and we know the difference that it makes, and we will actually try and buy more. Mm. Um, and again, the more fair trade that we can sell, then the more farmers can benefit from the fair trade price.